The topic that I'm going to cover is public transportation in urban areas. I will be talking about what it actually is, the history of public transportation, its present state in urban areas, and the future plans and ideas and hopes for public transportation. Public transportation is a shared passenger transportation service which is available for use by the general public. Public transportation services are usually funded by government subsidies and fares charged to each customer. The earliest public transportation was water transportation by ferries. People were also transported by stagecoach. The first organized public transit system within the city was in 1662 in Paris, France, known as the Omnibus. In 1806, the first passenger horse-drawn railway was opened. In 1825, George Stevenson built the locomotion in Northeast England. The modes of public transportation are airline, buses and coach, trains, commuter in the city and high-speed rail, tram and light rail, rapid transit, personal rapid transit, cable rail transit, ferries, motorcycles, and pedicabs. There are many forms of transportation. For urban areas, a few of the present modes in the very urban city of Washington, D.C. are Metro Rail, which makes it accessible for travel. All in D.C. surrounding areas as far as West Falls Church, Vienna, and Franconia. Also, the Metro Bus system which serves the local area and the surrounding region. Since D.C. has a frequent amount of tourists, they also have public transportation services to accommodate them if they want to tour certain sections of D.C., such as the National Mall tour buses. They also have specific buses, such as the D.C. Circulator, just for major locations in D.C., like the National Mall, Union Station, Georgetown, and the Convention Center. When you think about the future of public transportation, many different questions may be asked. What will improve, what will be gotten rid of, and what will be added? One thing that is already being looked at is the sustainability of public transportation. Sustainability is the ability to maintain at a certain level or rate and conserving an ecological balance by avoiding depletion of natural resources. Public transportation sustainability is a very important thing to improve and one of the main goals should be to lower the carbon imprint that the modes of public transportation have on the environment. Some ideas to increase sustainability are walking, carpooling, and biking. In DC, there is a biking system called Smart Ride DC. It was the first kind of network in North America. It was taken over by Capital Bike Share, which also serves Arlington County, Virginia, with 1,200 bikers operating from 140 stations. In conclusion, public transportation in urban areas has always been a great plan and system that has always found a way to improve and positively affect the area operated in and the environment long term.